Aftarat Matot These are the words of Yirmiyahu, the son of Hilkiyahu, one of the Kohanim living in Anatot, in the territory of Benjamin. The word of Adonai came to him during the days of Yoshiahu, the son of Ammon, king of Yehuda, in the thirteenth year of his reign. It also came during the days of Yehoiakim, the son of Yoshiahu, king of Yehuda, continuing until the eleventh year of Zedekiahu, the son of Yoshiahu, king of Yehuda, right up until the time Yerushalayim was carried away captive in the fifth month. Here is the word of Adonai that came to me. Before I formed you in the womb, I knew you. Before you were born, I separated you for myself. I have appointed you to be a prophet to the nations. I said, O oh Adonai Elohim, I don't even know how to speak. I'm just a child. But Adonai said to me, Don't say, I'm just a child. For you will go to whomever I send you, and you will speak whatever I order you. Do not be afraid of them, for I am with you, says Adonai, to rescue you. Then Adonai put out his hand and touched my mouth. And Adonai said to me, There I have put my words in your mouth. Today I have placed you over nations and kingdoms, to uproot and to tear down, to destroy and to demolish, to build and to plant. The word of Adonai came to me asking, Yirmiyahu, what do you see? I answered, I see a branch from an almond tree. Then Adonai said to me, You have seen well, because I am watching to fulfill my word. A second time the word of Adonai came to me asking, What do you see? I answered, I see a cauldron tilted away from the north over a fire fanned by the wind. Then Adonai said to me, From the north calamity will boil over on to everyone living in the land, because I will summon all the families in the kingdoms of the north, says Adonai. And they will come and sit, each one on his throne, at the entrance to the gates of Yerushalayim, opposite its walls all the way around, and opposite all the cities of Yehuda. I will pronounce my judgments against them, for all their wickedness in abandoning me, offering incense to other gods and worshipping what their own hands made. But you, dress for action, stand up and tell them everything I order you to say. When you confront them, don't break down, or I will break you down in front of them. For today, you see, I have made you into a fortified city, a pillar of iron, a wall of bronze against the whole land, against the kings of Yehuda, against its princes, against its Kohanim and the people of the land. They will fight against you, but they will not overcome you, for I am with you says Adonai, to rescue you. The word of Adonai came to me. Go and shout in the ears of Yerushalayim that this is what Adonai says. I remember your devotion when you were young. How, as a bride, you loved me. How you followed me through the desert, through a land not sown. Israel is set aside for Adonai, the first fruits of his harvest. All who devour him will incur guilt. Evil will befall them, says Adonai.